you know, just this long pattern of my life, you know. It always seems that something's always come along and opened up for me. And I'm, you know, I'm very aware of that. I'm, I'm pretty grateful. But, uh, you know, I'm, I'm getting, it, I'm at the, coming to the end of the trail now. But uh, it's been pretty amazing. It's an, an amazing, pretty amazing ride, you know. <laughs> it's good to see you, my friend. Hey, man. How are you doing? You brought your old guitar? My God. You, you think you could afford a new one. It's so big. Yes, I <laughs> Yeah, it is. That's, uh, it's a wonderful, uh, wonderful instrument. It is. I bought it in a that's, store in Nashville. The hits have been written on that ago. thing. Yes, yes. Many. Yeah. Yes. Many great songs. Yeah, yeah. My earliest memory of you, Gord, is in a little apartment somewhere in North Toronto. We were making instant coffee in the kitchen. You were asking me about uh, songs, and because uh, you were starting to write, and... Uh, and I, I had been writing for a little while, but not, not very much, not very long. You were working on a particular one then called Red Velvet, which is the one that I recorded. And I finally got around to recording. And a magnificent job, well, I, thank must, you I might add. Thank, thank it's you. the best version of that song we, we there try. is. Try. No, it's great, a great version. What key do you do it in? D? I do it low. low. It's like you told me to do... Uh, uh, American you said, said if you do the American National Anthem, you warned me one day, you said, be sure and start low. That's right. It's good <laughs> advice. A month ago in April, a day coat she came down, the dusty young is beginning to go. She didn't know I couldn't hold her, and it ain't not so far from town. And the last to come along slow to go Oh, now she's gone Walking down the night And the dusty arms begin to grow All dressed up in a red velvet And her high heels shoes so fine And the nights to come along slow to go Now if I don't want her gone before you can't keep revving on a bird farm like that. Oh, now she's gone. Oh, we changed key. Well, it's the way it is on the record. That's the autumn wind begin to blow. I know I blew it there at one point. I know those changes, but I can find them on the second pass. But yeah, well, I guess I could too. But uh, I wrote. I put too many chords in songs in those days. No, those are perfect chords. Are they? Yeah. Those are perfect chords. Well, that's good. Yeah. That's good. I was in Oklahoma and I heard uh, "Sundown" on on the radio, and that that was a big song. Yeah. And great arrangement too. Yeah. Great arrangement. Thank you. That's to me. That's when you really hit your hit your stride. I was jealous, actually. You was probably as jealous as hell. I was. I was jealous. Of that. <laughs> I wasn't. Be, I wasn't. Uh, I, I'm I, worried about that. I used to worry about the other I was people doing the horse so thing. Don't get jealous. I was doing the horse thing, and uh, it's difficult to do both. And I was trying to joke, and both kind of suffered. Eventually, the horse thing uh, pulled me through. Uh, cowboyography. I mean, without horses, there'd have been no cowboyography.